push back onto 33 and Saxo is their magical goes towards Saxo with the life break, but he has been lassoed. The control there momentarily, but it's taken off by the false promise as magical can to continue to go to work. He's looking towards Ace. Ace gets nuked down by the purifying flames. It's one for one at the moment, but NIP without their carry and crystallize, he's still good to go. Zips into the trees, finds 33. Magical jumps across. 33 is going to fall as well as two dead on NIP. Butter. He's still trying to poke careful. at them. He has to be careful in case Blizzy's able to get back in with a who stump. This is a big th steal. They'll back up. They've got Centaur stun now. They're really low on disables, as you can see with NIP. They don't have the chasing power. Troll's just getting killed. They have Lasso with no split, no Lasso. How do you actually right, keep the going to buy to back go? here. Magical tries to go forward with the life break. They've got four here. Can they punish Magical for this? He's still got the Aegis. Blizzy jumps in. Who stomp onto two? They're on top of Fada. Fada backing up with the Eye of the Storm. The oh, they got him! He tapped his strike. It's enough. Fada's dead for 50 seconds. Na'Vi, they'll get the kill. And Magical, he's still fighting away deep in the base. PPD, he's going to tick down to the Burning Spears. They have lost the Aegis. PPD he's and Fada so buying back. Though. Can Magical get out of here? That's the question. It doesn't look like he can. The rest of the team have already bailed. As Magical will fall, but I can get force forward and go into the blink. The counter plays there. PPD with telekinesis. Father's going to lead straight in with the BKP and Stadling down onto Blizzy. PPD not quite dead yet. Does fall as Magical has the magical damage to finish him off. Crystallize. He's been false promise. He's getting rooted up. He's able to waveform away. They need to get heals upon him. Saxa tries to jump in to finish off oh, them all, and they'll away. get him. That's going to be Crystallize dead. Magical on the back lines. He's looking for Ace. Heading forward here. Should be able to find the trail. The Burning Spears will have been enough to tick Ace down. It will. They'll get Ace, but it's going to cost them the life of Crystallize and of Magical by the looks of it. Well, I say that Ooh. though, Magical oh, no, it finally goes down. They do get both of the cores. Chu tries to TP out, but a Yule Scepter from Fada holds him in place as Na'Vi just getting a little too antsy. Oh. Oh, Chu's going to be there with the counterplay, jumping forward, but there's Fada with the Stalling thing straight away. 33 also leading in. Chu just getting melted, tries to TP out. There's no chance for that as they've lost two supports, one from each side. Two for PPD at the moment. Magical still trying his best with the BKP, but now the BKP is worn off. Has to be a little careful. Ace is heading in towards the fight. Fada's back in with the other storm. Magical jumps in, actually pushing there. Fada into the pit and in a bit of an awkward place to get back towards the rest of his teammates. He now looks towards 33. Oh my God, 33 days popping the BKP and Crystallize just gets shredded by the troll. Zaneka does manage to get the false promise out onto Magical in time. The Navi they're starting to fall apart a little bit. Yules up oh, the, from the Wind Panda, sending Magical up into the air. Ace, does he want to try and finish him off? No, he's backing off. With the BKB gone, they're a little scared of Magical. They have to be careful with how they approach this Huskar. He's going to have the Disarm available again. Jumps up towards Fada. Fada, he's keeping the distance. Blizzy's in with a Hustom. The double edge, they kill Fada. But yeah. Na'Vi, they've lost all five of them. Fada to finish Roche, get the Aegis. Now Ace is able to move in. They've got the control holding Magical up in the air as this Huskar. He'll cut down the healing wall, jump up towards Ace. They're trying to get rid of Seneca before he gets the nice. False Promise awesome. up. But the False Promise is there. But as you say, 33's control with the Wind Panda makes the majority of the False Promise useless as Magical taken down as well. Na'Vi mm -hmm. turning up a little too... Tough to really point to a standout performance because everyone's done their job. 33 just get jumped upon. He has been silenced as well, but oh, he's still going to get the split on. And with that stun, it's got to be over. It's got to be over. GG is indeed called as NIP. They don't mess around in game two. They make this look as easy as ever. And I can't say, like, not.